I am receiving a lot of questions and feedback from all of you. Thank you all for your love and support that you have given me. Amongst many other questions, there is one question that many of you have asked. And that question is that what is the difference between Microsoft certifications and Microsoft exams? So let's say you come on this Microsoft Learn site and now you want to browse what are the certifications and different exams that are available. Let's say you are a beginner. So you have to come to this page and scroll down and let's say you select beginner here. Now you can see all the certifications that are related to the beginner level. Now, if you pay a little attention here, you can see there is one exam here, which is exam easy 900 Microsoft Azure fundamentals. And there is one related certification as well, which is Microsoft certified Azure fundamentals. In fact, if you also see on the left hand side, you can see that there are two types. One is certification and the other one is exam. So what is the difference? Now, to clarify the difference, let me open both of these links. So this goes the exam and this goes the certificate. Coming on this page, you can see all the information that you would need to pass the exam. So here is small description of the exam. Then you see uh, how you can schedule the exam. What is the fees? On the other hand, if you go to the Microsoft certified page, then here you can see uh, the skills that are measured and you can also see the Microsoft Learn. So here you can start your course. You can start learning about this certificate and it's a very well uh, laid out uh, course uh, from Microsoft and I always always recommend to anyone who wants to start with any certificate to first go through these learning path. Now here if you see there is an interesting image here. Looking at this image you can easily make out what is the difference between an exam and a certificate. So here you can see that you must give an exam. It says take one exam and then it says earn the certification so this means essentially that you have to clear an exam and then you earn a certificate so that's the difference between an exam and a certificate also the discount question so whenever you are talking about discount the discount is always applied to the exam why because the cost is associated with the exam right on the other hand certificate is just a testimony of the fact that you have the required knowledge and your knowledge is now also verified and validated by microsoft for those who are new to this channel and in case you have missed the previous videos which i made on how you can get a free microsoft voucher this voucher will enable you to clear all the exams, the fundamental exams for free. For example, AZ-900, AI-900 and DP-900. And you can save a good amount by using this method because you now don't have to pay any fees that is associated with these certificates. Besides this, I have made one more video on how to schedule Microsoft exams. The most popular option to schedule Microsoft exam these days when we are all working from home is to schedule with Pearson VUE. So don't forget to watch both of these videos as they will help you a lot to achieve Microsoft certificates. I will see you in the next video. Till then, keep learning, stay fit and thanks for watching.